I got this question from Jenny. My IV startup skills are not so good, but I'm interested in IV hydration anyway. Any advice? Hey, Nursepreneurs, it's Katie Harris, and we're helping nurses to make an impact and start a business. So sure, yeah, I have some advice here. So if your IV skills are not up to par, and let's face it, not everybody has great IV skills, or maybe you haven't been in the hospital, or maybe you work somewhere that you just don't place IVs, and that's not a big deal, right? So as the business owner, you may start out being the only person in the business, but it doesn't have to be that way. So you have a couple of options. Option number one, is to just be the business owner and you hire people to nurses who have really awesome IV skills and make that part of your job description. Like if you're gonna work with me, I need you to have awesome IV skills because it is important. Uh, people, especially lay people are petrified of IVs and it's like one of the biggest hindrances of IV therapy is, is people say, I'm so scared of IVs. What if the person has to you know, stick me multiple times or I get bruising and, and all that kind of stuff. So it is a big deal. You do want somebody that has really good IV skills, but you don't have to be the person that does it. So some of the business ventures that I've started up, I've never actually worked in the business. I've only been the owner of the business and it was worth it to me to pay other people to run it, such as concierge nursing. I never did the concierge nursing. I always hired nurses to go out and do the concierge nursing for me. And that's one option. Option number two is to, I don't know, get a per diem job in the hospital and start putting IVs in. That's, that's another option. You just have to practice. Practice makes perfect. That might be the only way that you're going to get really good if you want to do this as a solopreneur and, and not have to pay other people to uh, do the IVs for you. And the third option, which kind of goes along with that because it's still going to require practice, is to just purchase a vein finder. You can get these on Amazon.com or one of the multiple vendors like Henry Schein, um, McKesson, Olympia. All of those uh, will have vein finders that you can easily get. But I would definitely practice and maybe practice on yourself or a friend who will be very forgiving and get those IV skills down. Otherwise, like I said, your option, your other big option is to just hire people with awesome IV skills. And a lot of people can hire EMT and paramedics because they have awesome IV skills and uh, they might be less expensive than a nurse. Hope this helps. And stay tuned, continue watching more videos to find out more about IV hydration and how to get started in this business.